Hello? Cran? Why are you just standing there? Let's see what this bad boy can do. Change the scene to horror man. I I can do anything. I can do anything. Is this that moment? The moment your mind bleeds? The moment everything changes? But do I stop this? I think perhaps this is the perfect opportunity for me to go. But then on the other hand, perhaps I could stop Cran's mind from exploding. Would that work? I mean, time can be changed, can't it? I mean, I've changed time before. But what if I caused it? What if the reason everything starts was because of me? What if I created myself? Whoa, my non-existent head is hurting again. I'm looking for ice. Not the solid liquid, the one they call ice. Cran! Yoo-hoo! Yeah, he can't hear you. Ah, there you are. I found you. I wasn't even hiding. I'm just naturally invisible. What I mean is I've been searching all of time for you. <sighs> Next you'll reveal your face to be a Kranatoka from an alternate timeline, or the future who's come back in time to stop me from doing... something. Ah. Well, now I don't want to reveal my face. Just take off your mask, Kranatoko. Fine, fine, fine. Right, so the situation is now even more complicated. We have a Kranatoko over there whose head is about to explode, and now you. Tell me everything that's happened to you and why you're here. Well, I'm from the very, very far future. You mean... I regained my body? Uh, it's complicated. <laughs> Try me. I can't, or it may never happen. Ryan, I was told my entire future and it played out exactly as it was supposed to happen. Even when time was changed. You might as well. Look, this is all I'll tell you as a sneak peek, as it would be. There's a war coming. Against who? Is it really that difficult to figure out? Against Charlie. But what does he want? Why is he doing everything he's doing? Because he's trying to make this world real to him. Trust me, you've not seen him at his worst. You think you have, but you haven't. The worst is yet to come. So is that why you're here? To stop it before it begins? No. I'm here to make it begin. I'm sorry, what? This whole time we've been talking. I've been hacking into Kranatoka's code. Breaking it. Changing it. Soon, his mind will break, Charlie will lose everything, and he will begin his journey to be the ruler of our universe. But you're me from the future! You're one of the good guys! Uh, I'm pretty sure I never actually said that. You mean I want this to happen? I end up wanting this to happen? Again, it's... complicated. But when you arrived, you said you were looking for me. I was to stall you. Everything has happened exactly as it should have happened. I also need one more thing from you. The code word. Code word? Well, this device I have, hacked into the game by the brilliant mind Charlie has, will only begin to destroy Cran's mind when the code word is spoken with your voice. The code word is your name, Ice. You have a device created by Charlie that only begins the main process at the sound of my voice? Some genius Charlie is. Anyway, I'm not going to say the code word, especially considering I don't know what it is. Oh, but you will. I come from the future where it happened at this very moment. It's just a matter of time. I see. Well, good luck with that. Code word ICE accepted. <laughs> I see! That's totally cheating! Nonetheless, you still technically said ice. And now, the future...
can truly begin. another pack opening video I have bright lights which help illuminate the area when I'm doing a pack opening video this time we shall be opening the outer room explorers packs 24 of them of course with the platinum pack as well right so last time I asked you guys to post your character name server whether you're Empire or Republic in the comment section uh, to win a hyper crate well not not this exact hyper crate but a hyper crate of the outer room explorers packs and I can now reveal that the winner is, and I'm not being, and I, and I am being serious with this name. This is a real name, a real character name that somebody went with. It's really cool. <laughs> a big fat guy on the beggar and colony. That is, that is a real name. Somebody actually went with that, and they managed to get that as well. As, <laughs> well, this was the person who actually got it, obviously. So congratulations, a big fat guy. You have won yourself a hyper crate. Please check your in-game mail. As it will arrive in about 36 hours from when I'm recording this, so yeah, yeah. Right, and if you would like there, if you'd like a chance to win one of five of the next packs, what what are the next packs called? I don't really know. Hold on, I'll find out now. Uh, it's called the Wild Space. So if you'd like to win one of, f did I say five or six? I I don't know if I said five or six. Yeah, let's go with six. One of six. I, mean, I think it's usually five, but I'll go with six this time. One of six of the Wild Space packs. Then all you have to do is post your character name, your server, and whether you're Republic or Empire in the comments below. I'm going to say this now because I do see a lot of people doing this. Please only post one one character because I see many people posting like all of their characters to increase their chances of winning. No, I the rule the rules are I don't I've never really specifically said, but the rules from this point onwards, which even though they should have been in the past, is that you only get one entry. Any other entries I will just delete and just keep one entry. It's just to make it fair on anybody else who just only does it once. Okay? Uh the closing date I think will probably be you I assume about the 1st of September. I assume that's probably when the final pack is going to be out because obviously it's going to be. Uh, there's usually like four packs in every shipment apart from like the nightlife ones. Uh, and obviously, Wild Space is the last one before Knights of the Fallen Empire. Exciting times. Uh, so, yes, around about the 1st of September is when the next pack will be out, I believe. Shall we get into it? No. Let's look at the Togruta. The Togruta! Oh my god. Obviously, there's a, there's a Togruta and um, the next Stronghold uh, in this patch, which I shall do a video of tomorrow. I plan to do like a video of both of those tomorrow. <gasps> Granatoka has come online! Ah! Um, so yes, I hope you like the intro, by the way, if you ever do watch the intro. Right, let's get into it. Um, I may sound very uninterested as well throughout this entire video because come back from work I am tired I, I I I did the late last night I worked 1 till 10 and then had to come home go straight to bed get up for 7 o'clock start I know I'm talking about boring real life stuff but that's that's I'm just telling you the reason why I may sound uninterested throughout this entire video just just putting that excuse out there yeah excuse excuse uh, anyway so let us open the platinum pack first Hopefully we get something interesting, but we probably won't. No, of course we won't. Intelligence Officer Pants. I need to also be more careful when I'm actually making this video as well. I need to centerize like the previews and everything so that I'm not editing it awkwardly. Uh, so anyway, uh, and there we go. It's I don't know why this is rare, like or ultra rare, whatever they call it. It's just looks like some ordinary pants. Really? I say pants, trousers. I'm British. I'm British. I should be saying trousers. So, yeah. Th th there we go. I kind of wish I could get, like, decorations, but... No. No. I'm not that lucky. I'm never that lucky. Anyway, let us begin opening the main pack. So, the first one... Do I normally do it that way, or do I normally do it that way? Oh, well, never mind. Uh, the first pack contains... 
So reputation, I will take that. Thank you very much. Darth and they do lower robe. That's a robe? What? <laughs> that is not a robe. They're pants. They're underwear. What? Well, there's like some little. I could, you can see in the icon, very, very small little. What, shin pads or something? I, I say shin, I don't. What parts of the body the shin again? I forget. What? What? What is that? Are they. I don't really know. That. Maybe knee pads? I don't know. Something, but. Yeah, there we go. It's. It's. Lower robe, apparently, but that doesn't really look like a lower robe. Yeah. Anyway, let's move that away. Uh, we also got a high rotty YH thirty three. So let's take a look at that. How many high rotties do I even have? I don't really know. I have one, two, three. Did I say thirty three? Yes, I did. And there we go. It's lovely. Oh, that matches Kran that matches Kranosuke perfectly, don't you think? I really don't. See, I would, I would go for that mount for Kranitoko, but I don't know. He kind of actually thinking about it. What? There's like no shadows on this mount, like none at all. Okay, maybe like there, but hmm. This looks awkwardly textured, don't you think? Is it just me? This definitely looks pretty awkward. Cause you know how sometimes you'll see like um some previews of it on like you know some I say data mine because you we shouldn't be talking about data mine but you know how you see like some data mine previews it kind of looks like that like not not fully finished so I don't know but again it looks nice you know it, it matches Kranitoko's what was that is 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 my stronghold merging with someone else's or is Ian in my stronghold and... No, it's just me. It's just me. Okay, anyway, so yeah. yeah it just looks like that. It's, it's kind of weird. I am now stalling. Hurry up, Charlie. Uh, let's go this way around. Why not? The next pack contains... Uh, some armored diplomat boots. Some armored diplomat boots. There we go. Some armored... Again, with the textures. What is... Hmm. Why do I get the feeling there's a problem with this cartel pack? The textures just seem off. It, it might just be me. Honestly, it might just be me. But maybe it's because I'm too close. I don't know. It just... Hmm. Hmm. We'll see if the, if the same problem happens to many other things. A uh, bounty holding cell? Ooh. That can go in my bounty hunter room. Because obviously on my um, Korriban stronghold, I have like rooms dedicated to each class. So that... That can go to... Uh, about hungry. But of course, let's preview it right now. It looks really awesome from the preview window though, I'll give it that. Bounty holding so again! It's not really got the shadows. Not really. I get the feeling is it my is it my textures? Is it my game that's doing it? Because everything else in the game is textured properly. Or could it could it be no, I was gonna say, could it be the lighting in the in the room, but no it's not because it's in the preview window. It just it just everything seems off. Yeah, look look at it there. Look 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 at the blueness of that and then look at that. It seems off. I don't get it. I might go nuts. I might be going nuts. Let me let me get rid of that a minute. Uh oh, thinking about it. It could be the lights actually. Thinking about it, hold on. Uh Yeah, it might have just been the lights. I'm just I'm going out of my mind, I really am. Hopefully in this pack video I should reach, is it champion? No, it's legend. I should reach legend uh, with the Estran S exports. Export? Exports. You know what I meant? Uh, ceiling cages as well. Ooh, ooh. Let's take a look at those. And there it be. How about that? That will definitely also go in my bounty hunter room. If, I, if it has like a ceiling. It should have a ceiling hook, shouldn't it? I think so, on the Dromon Cast one. Ah, oh, poor soul. Poor soul. Might want to get rid of the skeleton though, if you're gonna... <laughs> I, don't, I don't think I'd want a dead body lingering in my, uh, in my house. No, but... Eh, he's to our own, he's to our own. 
Oh, that's why there's probably no shadows. Because I've got these two lights here illuminating the environment, there's like little to no shadows at all. It's like the tiniest, as you can see, like the tiniest shadow which Kranotoka is making. So that's, so that, that's probably why things might look a little bit awkward. I thought to myself, oh, lighting this room up will make this uh, pack videos way better. You'll be able to see things a lot better now. No, it's kind of made things worse, but never mind. We also got the emote air drums. Do -do -do -do. I can be anyway. <laughs> uh, air drums. Oh, it actually has a sound effect. I didn't actually put that in. That is actually the emote. Well, okay. I wish the Xanthos could come with music then, if that's the case. But nah, it won't. Uh, the next pack. Contains du, 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 another one of the armor diplomat boots, uh, a cartomatic certificate, thank you, some more companion gifts, and contraband runner helmet. Yeah, it's more of a scout helmet. Oof, no thanks, no thanks. Next pack contains uh, more reputation, thank you very much. Fire green that pace, no, no, no. Uh, contraband runner's braces. Excuse me, let me take off my gloves so that you can see the braces. <laughs> I always have to do this. There we go, and there are the braces. These things are right here. Eh, they would go well with the uh, intelligence officers. I, I, they kind of look similar. You look how tight-fitting those braces are compared to the trousers. The trousers look, look also like they're tight-fitting. See? See? It's just, it's just me. It's just me. Stop coming online and offline, Ian! Stop it! Stop it! Uh, and we also got the B400 cybernetic. Oh god, more cybernetic armor. Great. Uh, have I shown you this before in a previous pack? Are they like releasing old stuff in new packs? I don't really know, but this. I, I keep seeing like B400 something, and I don't know if it's the same or not. But anyway, there we go. It actually looks pretty good. That That is very Deus Ex, isn't it? Like very Adam Jensen, I should say. That's what Adam Jensen would wear if he was in Star Wars. The next pack contains do, 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 a Gurian Storm. Let us take a look at that mount. And there it be. It's interesting. Oh, it's got a nice little transparent kind of effect to the uh, sides. What kind of texture is that? Anyway, it's kind of nice. It's kind of cool. Um, but again, it's very basic. It's very noobish, to be honest. I don't know why I'd like to pay money for that, but, eh, Bioware thinks it appeals to me, so, eh, eh, clearly. We also have some body armor. We have the Drifter Gauntlet. Oh, oh no, I, I was going to say, let me <laughs> take off my gloves, but no, it's the gauntlets, isn't it? Uh, we've got the gauntlets, and we've got the breastplate. Ew, it turns my armor into a horrible green. And there we go. It's, well, it has like a little, nice little robe at the back, I suppose. It just sort of hangs down on one side. That's quite cute. And obviously the gloves as well. Get close up of those. The gloves are quite nice. What if I were to just wear the gloves on my own? Uh, why did I close that? I need that. Um, gloves. Yeah, the gloves are quite nice. I really like the gloves. Just a shame the breastplate just kind of... It doesn't match. Not really. It, it's, it's okay. But I just don't feel like it matches. Not really. I suppose like the tiniest bit of brown there compared to that brown, maybe, but no, no. Not for me, really. The next pack contains... Uh, we've got some more decorations. Lovely. Some more reputation. Uh, I need to move you... No, wait. I was going to say I need to move you away because you're part of the old pack, but no, you're not. Tactical Infantry Supplementary Body Armor. Da -da 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 -da. Why does that look familiar? That really does f look familiar now. Seriously, I... I hope I hope Bio really aren't just adding stuff from previous packs in the shipment and into this one. Uh, when I loaded this up, there's like a little, I don't know, hollow effect that came up, which is weird. I wonder if it'll do that again. Yeah, there it is. It's, it just did it again. Hold on. I'll move this out of the way so that the text isn't in the way. See? What? Why? Why is it doing that? What? What's the, what's the little round thing? That's weird. That's very weird. Uh, we also got the Mandalorian floor, floor torch, really? Okay. And there it be. Ooh, that's actually quite nice. It's a nice little fire as well. Ah, isn't that cute? 
That looks like uh, Yoda, don't you think? It looks like Yoda mixed with Simba's face paint uh, drawing. The things I see. The things I see. Seriously. The things I say out loud as well are sort of like the stuff which you would say after coming straight out of a dream. So, you know how if you wake up, you'll be like, Oh, put the kettle on the grass! You say, you say, you just say random stuff like that if you just come out of a dream and somebody's trying to speak to you. It's, it's kind of like that, the stuff I say. Uh, and we've had a look at that. Anyway, so now we shall move on to another pack. We can get rid of you now. Uh, what do we have? Some Jawa junk. Lovely. Uh, da -da -da -da. a title, Galactic Wanderer. I don't have that. Oh, I have that. I don't need it, I mean. And we've got another mount. The Zerka Runabout. Oh, it's a nice little car as well. Oh, it's a nice little green car as well. That's nice. That's very nice. It's a mint green as well. Just fits through the door. <laughs> I don't really use the cars. I really should, but it I just it kind of annoys me that your companions don't get in the other seat. I'd like it if your companions could get into the other seat. Maybe they'll add that in Knights of the Fallen Empire. They won't, but maybe they will. I've got to speed this up because this video is nearly half an hour long. I've really got to speed it up. Next pack contains some more reputation. Uh, a juvenile crate trophy. Ooh, that sounds exciting. I'm guessing that's going to go on the wall, perhaps? I, I just realised a way as well to get to decorations pretty quickly. Uh, click on a hook and then click there. And there it be! I know, I, I didn't realise that until like five minutes ago. Although, uh, oh, there it is. Lovely. Hide hooks. And there we go. Ooh, ooh, that is cool. It'd be nice if it would actually, I don't know, sway to the side as if it really was on display, like held in place but on display. That'd be a nice touch, but yeah, it won't do that. But yeah, that's, that's quite nice. It really is quite nice. It's looking into my soul. And we've got another decoration as well Flag Mandalorian. As if I didn't have enough flags. Uh, da, 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 da. What am I looking for? I'm looking for, I'm looking for. Flag Mandalor. Where are you? Oh, these. Oh, girls, I can only go on a wall. Oh, okay. Fine, we'll put it on a wall. Uh, Flag Mandalorian. There you be. I said. I, I. Doesn't always work. It doesn't always work. Because uh, if you want to click on it, you can't, because you have to actually. Always... It did work, but now it's sort of stopped working now, which which is annoying. Never mind about my trick, it doesn't really work. Although it does sort of tell you where it is in your collections, I suppose. Maybe. Civic and banners. Banners, there we go. Uh, <laughs> eventually got there. I really need to hurry this video up! God damn it. And there it is. The Mandalorian flag. I don't know why flags can't be both on the wall and ground flags as well, like standing flags, but... I don't know. I guess Bio I guess Bioware just wants more reasons to say you the same stuff. Yeah, sounds like Bioware. Got another 15 packs. Let's see what we get now. We get Reputation. Thank you very much. Uh, Armored Diplomat Lowered Robe. Wait. Didn't that, isn't that what we got? No, I was, think, I was thinking of um, Darth and Anders. Uh, well, however you say it. Darth and Anders. It's a weird name. Uh, oh, that's the uh, armor dip stuff. Okay. If we get the full set, I'll show you the full set. But for now, ooh, that's quite nice. Stop coming online, Ian. Uh, yeah, that's quite nice. Kind of, kind of weird to have like a cape with a robe. Doesn't really go together, does it? It's just something off about it. Yeah. Anyway. Ah, we have the drifter lower body armor. I've also got the upper body armor, so we'll take a look at both of those together. Ooh, they're quite nice, actually. They're quite nice trousers. Uh, where, where... Did, did it open? Oh! You're hiding behind! Of course you are! Ooh! Again! It's, it's, it's odd. It is, it's, it's, it's very... Uncharted-like, isn't it? Fut futuristic Uncharted-like. As in Uncharted, the video game series. Yeah, you got, like, the boots, you know, to go adventuring in, and... I don't know, it kind of looks like the... Sort of scarf, which Nathan Drake has in the third one, sort of, but not really. This is uh, I'm babbling. Silly, silly me. Seriously, the stuff that comes out of my mouth is just laughable. Seriously, not laughable as in. Ha ha ha! That's a good joke. Laughable as in what? 
What? What? What are you going on about, Charlie? Uh, but still, we're going to have one of those torches. Don't know if I'll take it, but might sell it, might use it. Uh, tactical infantry, alpha body armor. Have I shown you that? Didn't I get something tactical? Yeah, there we go. Uh, ha! Something new. Something old, something new. Something borrowed, something blue. Uh, ooh, it turns my entire clothes white. White as a feather. Aha! Trousers don't go well with that, but we're not looking at the trousers because obviously there's like special trousers for this suit. But again, it's quite nice if you want to be like a prop. That might go to um, Lyshaw, perhaps. He lied, but it probably will go to Lyshaw. Again, he's lying. I wonder if they change colour as well. If I, were to, if I were to dye this, will those... Will these orange bits change to a different colour? I'd like to think so, but I don't think. I wonder if I can actually. I wonder if I can actually do this. Let's go to that, and let's say I wanted it red. No, it doesn't. Oh, that really would have been a nice touch, by the way. But never mind. Next pack contains something good, something good, something good. Bear of braces, which I've already shown you. Reputation. Lieutenant Eresso's customization nine. And here he is with a completely new face. He's regenerated with a scar across his face as well and a weird moustache and a weird horrible hairstyle where they've sort of combed their hair over and then combed their hair up. Which I really hate. I really hate it when people do that. You see all the, you see like chavs these days and they just sort of do it that way. It's just like, no, I just want to straighten it. I just want to straighten your hair. Just, 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 uh. Anyway. <laughs> oh, there's one for Gus Tuno. Ooh. Wait. Gus Tuno? Who's Gus Tuno? Is that a smuggler companion? Maybe, because I haven't got all the way through the smuggler class yet, so maybe he could be. Because I don't remember him in any other previous um, class stories, so maybe. Maybe. Next pack contains! We've got 12 more! Uh, da, 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 da. Anything new? Uh, PW3ST sniper rifle? It's more of a sniper rifle than previous sniper rifles have been. Uh, are they, I was going to say, are they floating on the sides? But no. Yeah. So there we go. Kranatoko's going to shoot at you. He, he, he's going to shoot at you if he... Straighten up! Oh, whatever. There we go. There's the sniper rifle. <laughs> the next pack contains... Do, 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 do. Ooh, a new pet. Yay, I love pets. Uh, Waspak Gizka. Oh, it's so cute. Hello. Hello. You alright? You okay? Yeah? Yeah? You gonna follow me? Come on. Come on, little Gizka. Ah, it's so cute. Wait, it has no arms. Does it have no arms? Where, where have we gone? Wow. Wow. I mean, obviously, you know, you get like dogs and all that. You know, they walk on four legs, but you, you, you walk on two legs and have like no arms. That, that must be a bit awkward for you, right? Yeah? Do you agree with me? You have no clue what I'm saying, do you, Gizka? You can't even hear me. Got some more reputation and pretty much the exact same customization I just got. Lovely. The next pack contains... Uh, da -da -da -da, more reputation. Mandalorian weapon rack. Ah, I remember hearing about this. I'm glad I've got it. The thing that surprised me is that it goes on the wall. Ah, it makes sense that it goes on the wall because it holds vibroblades and swords and things like that. And your your shotguns, apparently. <laughs> uh, but that's quite nice. That is very nice. That might, that might go well in the uh, Yavin 4 stronghold. Maybe. That would definitely go well in the Yavin 4 stronghold. And that is where it's going to go and stay. Or will it? Maybe it could go... Mm. I was going to say maybe with the bounty hunter, but no, that wouldn't make sense, would it? Uh, what classes have a crate dragon in it? I don't really know. I mean, technically all of them if you count, like, um, the operations, but, yeah. We also have the contraband runner jacket. Um, yeah. I, I don't really know what to say about that. It's, um, it's okay, but it's very puffy. It's very army-like. Yeah, that's, that's all I can really say about it. Next pack contains... Da, 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 da. Uh, B4 cybernetic upper body armor. Have I shown you that one? No, I've shown you the lower body armor, but we've also got the tactical infantry supplementary body armor. Have I shown you that one? 
I have. So, before 100, let's take that and that. Wait, I was going to say, I thought it was bikini then. What? Well, why would I give Granitoko a bikini? Well, he would look fabulous in a bikini, let me tell you. Let me tell you. And there we go. It's almost complete. I think I just need, like, braces and a helmet and a belt. Yeah, but there we go. That is almost the full set. And it looks... Ooh, is that, is that wires coming out of his arms? Ooh, that must hurt. But then, I go, of course, you've got to imagine his whole body is just wires. So why would it hurt if he can't even feel it? So, yeah. The next pack contains... Da -da -da, sparring droid. Ooh, is that like a... Oh, it's a regen ability. Lovely. Let's take a look at that. Surely that would hurt if you're punching metal. But, oh well. Oh! Okay, so am I supposed to be hitting you and then... What do you do? You damage me or do you... I don't know, heal me up? Are you healing me? Is that shock healing me or is that damaging me? I assume it's damaging me. You know, being like, Oh, how dare you hit me! I'm going to shock you now. Mwahahaha! <laughs> Aha! We have the full set of the Tactical Infantry set. So let's take a look at the full set. And here is the full set. Again, it would work well on a trooper. Maybe a bounty hunter if you got rid of the helmet. But, yeah, it's it's quite nice. Obviously, again, maybe the bounty hunter if you got the right die. It's still a shame that these things don't change colour with a die, but, eh, I can live with it. Seven more packs to go, and the next one contains another weapon rack. I'm going to take. I'm actually going to take another one of those because that that's actually pretty cool. Uh, and stuff I don't really need. I've got so many XP boosts, and again, it is so annoying that you cannot merge these because they're bound at the moment. Why can't you just merge? Well, no, oh, of course, because they're different times. That's why. I was going to say, why couldn't you merge them? But of course, you open them at different times, and if you were to merge them, the game would be like, oh, well, what, what am I doing? I, I, what? What's, what what timer overrides what? It's, it'd, be, it'd be all confusing for the game to handle. The next game... The next game? The next pack contains... I was thinking about the game to handle. Uh, juvenile crate trophy. I got another one of those. How rare are they? I don't know. Hmm. Uh, Drifter lower body armor, have I shown you that one? I've shown you the upper body armor, and I've shown you the lower body armor, so we don't need to take a look at another one of those. Five more packs to go! I'm just trying to speed this along because this video is incredibly long. Another... Uh, I was going to say, another crate Dragon? What? Um, actually... Yes! I've got another crate Dragon trophy. Oh. Wait, 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 wait. Didn't you just tell me? Wait, that just that just disproved my point. I got myself a crate dragon trophy, put it there, got myself another one, and then it overread this timer when it merged with that. So why can't that happen with that as well? Bioware, what what are you doing? What why 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 are you doing it there but not there? Okay, and and the answer to that question was it overrode that timer and pretty much reset it. Yay. Uh, Mandalorian wall sconce? Is it sconce or sconce? I can never tell. You know, it seems like they released this pack at the right time as well with the stronghold because I'm getting a lot of stuff. Oops, sorry. I'm getting a lot of stuff that really would work well in the Yavin 4 stronghold. Don't you think? I mean, that's pretty cool. Really cool. That would work so well in the Yavin stronghold. And I can't wait to get that. That's going to be so cool. What's behind the waterfall? Is there something behind the waterfall? find out tomorrow or you could just buy it now and find out right now you probably already know I'm not gonna I'm, I'm gonna try and avoid spoilers if there is something behind the waterfall but there's probably nothing interesting it's probably I don't know just like a codex entry maybe most likely four more packs to go we now have Darth and mask uh, again again that weird name I cannot pronounce oh oh my that is it clips through <laughs> Clips through the hood. Let me take that off and we'll take a look at it again. I don't like it that it clips through the hood, so yeah. Um, that is... That is something, isn't it? It's like something you see from the mummy. God. I'd like to see the full set. I really would, because I think that would look amazing. And uh, what do we have here? The commemorative statue of Shay Vizsla. Let's take a look at that. It goes on a large hook, I believe. And here it 
is, and it is amazing. This must be rare. It must be. I mean, look, look at her. She's just, she's just going for it. Oh God. Seriously fantastic. I love it so much. I hope you're jealous. Is it, is, is it rusted as well? Does it look? Has it got that rusted effect? I think it sort of does, which is a nice touch. I think. Look at her. Where have you gone? Are you, are you trapped outside, little Jinx? Are you Jinx? You're not Jinx. You're a... What are you called? I keep forgetting what you're called. You're a... You're a... You're a... You're a... Gizka! Aw. Were you trapped outside? Poor little Gizka. Three more packs to go! Three more packs to go! We have... More reputation. A landslide assault speeder. What kind of speeder is that? Let's take a look. Whoa! Okay. It's like a little mini tank. That's... Quite cool. I've never had. No I don't think I've actually got a tank in my collections. Whoa, that is. Oh, I'm tempted to make this my new mount now. <laughs> that is really cool. I'm so happy I got this. Look at it. It's just a shame it doesn't shoot. It'd be it'd be a nice oh, that, unless it's a flare. Uh, how do you do flares again? Is it Control Z? Yeah, it does shoot. Aha! It shoots. <laughs> uh, I could do this all day. Oh god. <laughs> oh god, I'm excited over a mount. That is so sad, but so exciting. I always forget to check previous mounts as well if they have a flare. Um, I'm trying to remember what other, fla well, what other mounts we might have got that may have a flare. I don't know. Probably all of them, most likely. Uh, and we've also got a Mandalorian tracker. And there he is with one of the most ugliest masks. And there he is with one of the most ugliest masks I have ever seen. But hey! At least he looks cool in general. The second to last pack contains... More reputation. I said I was going to reach Legend, but it doesn't look like it's actually going to happen. Hmm. Uh, dark pink and dark grey dye module. Um, no, I, d I don't think so. Um, no, 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 not gonna happen. Not gonna happen, people. I'm sorry. No. The final pack contains. Obviously, we got uh, r um, another Zerka runabout as well. Uh, it doesn't say. No, that doesn't say it has a flare anyway. So there we go. Uh, and we finally have. More reputation, Zerka runabout again, and I'm gonna do that lower robe again. How close are we to reaching legend anyway? Uh, Estran, Estran, Estran. Oh, so we've still got, I'd say, another pack to go then. Another hyper crate to go, so I'll probably get it in the next pack video. Alright, fine, fine, fine. So, anyway, that has been the pack video for the Outer Rims Explorer pack. It's a bit of a eh episode this time, I know, because I'm just so tired, so I probably sound stupid. I've probably said stupid stuff, most likely, so I apologize for that. But we've got some really cool stuff, as you can see. I put the correct tra trophy away because uh, I just wanted to show off Shea Vizsla. And we'll fade out with her looking awesome. Just, oh, I'm lost for words, I really am. So thank you very much for watching, ladies and gentlemen. I think he's just pooted. And I will see you next time. And a farewell to you.